And first at four today, a sad sight in Scottsburg, Indiana, as a 102 year old lumber business is left in ashes. Yeah, that fire destroying the building last night. WDRB's Dalton Godby gives us a closer look at all this damage and explains what fire officials think happened. Practically everything destroyed in Wednesday night's fire at Vail Lumber Company. The smoke is still rolling as crews try and get this mess cleaned up. This business belonged to my grandfather. E.O. Vale. He started it in 1920 and it's been in the family all those years, 102 years. Vale Lumber Company is a staple of the Scottsburg community. It's evident here where people came to see the damage for themselves. Its founder's granddaughter, Suzanne Berry, among them. It's heartbreaking to see it go down. This was the scene Wednesday night. Scottsburg Fire says it started around 1030 in the evening and blazed quickly. There was a fire already through the roof of the structure. Uh, so at that time, we were already behind the eight ball. Chief James Ritchie says fire crews went into defense, knowing the building was a total loss. The priority was to stop the spread into Scottsburg Square. Not clear what started the fire, but the suspicion says the weather. It does seem like it may have played a factor just simply because it was very gusty winds and lines were whipping and so on and there were some reports of some arcs however that you know it's undetermined thursday the work steadied as smoke rolled through the devastation my heart broke all i could think of was my mother she's deceased but she would just be devastated to think that the store as we always called it was gone the scottsburg community has been comforting the owners say as a family debates the next steps for its century old business. There could have been a lot more damage and I'm thankful we have some great firefighters. The state fire marshals are investigating this scene to try and find an exact cause for this fire. In Scottsburg, Indiana, Dalton Godby, WDRB News.